slow walking speed in elderly, a sign of approaching Alzheimer's. According to a recent research published in the December 2, 2015, issue of Neurology, the Medical Journal of the American Academy of Neurology. How fast elderly people walk may be related to the amount of myeloid they have built up in their brains. Even if they don't yet have symptoms of Alzheimer's disease. Natalia Del Campo, PhD, of the Center of Excellence in Neurodegeneration, University Hospital Toulouse in France is the study author. The study was done as a part of multi-domain Alzheimer preventive trial, supported by the French Ministry of Health. Positron emission tomography scans of the brain is used to measure the amyloid plaques in the brain. Amyloid plaques consist of dense deposits of a protein called beta amyloid. Progressive buildup of myeloid plaques in the brain has been associated with the development of Alzheimer's disease. Amyloid plaques are often associated with dementia. The researchers found an association between slow walking speed and amyloid in several areas of the brain, including putamen. Putamen is a key region involved in motor function. The amyloid level accounted for up to 9% of the difference in walking speed. The relationship between amyloid levels and walking speeds did not change with age, education level, or amount of memory problems. Even subtle walking disturbances in addition to memory concerns may signal Alzheimer's disease. Even before people show any clinical symptoms. High levels of physical activity and cardiovascular fitness, two parameters closely linked to gait speed. Have a protective effect against brain aging and Alzheimer's. Thanks for watching. Please click the link in description for more information.